In this video, we'll initiate the startup of the Optima Plus and Optima Plus Inverter by programming the controller in just six steps. Check the condensing unit's instructions and installation guides for more details. Don't forget your safety equipment. If the unit is on, disconnect the power supply by turning the main switch. Remove the DI1 link and turn the unit on. Press the upper button for 5 seconds. R05 will be displayed. Scroll to R12 and set up the value to 0 to switch the controller functionality off. Use the upper and lower buttons to scroll through the menu. Confirm your choice by using the button in the middle. Scroll to O30 and select the refrigerant. Select the value depending on your refrigerant. In this example, 36 for R513A. Choose if to work on pump down or on off mode. In the on off mode, the condensing unit works without the solenoid valve and your compressor will be regulated by the application's thermostat. We don't advise the on off mode as there's a risk of damaging the condensing unit. Scroll to C33 and set up the pump down pressure. 0.9 bar for scroll compressor. This value is application and refrigerant dependent. For the Optima Plus inverter unit, set the suction temperature with R23 parameter. The value is based on your evaporating temperature, in this example, minus 10 degrees Celsius. Disconnect the power supply by turning the main switch. Connect the DI1 link and turn the unit on. Scroll to R12 and set the value to 1 to switch the controller functionality on.